New tonight, Fox 13's Carla Byron spoke with the girl's grandfather about how he's honoring her memory. Five-year-old Madeline Nichols was preparing for kindergarten. She's ready, she's happy, she was a spunky, spunky girl. But instead of choosing a backpack for her, her family is now choosing an urn. I got the park behind me where we used to play, and now she's across the street in the funeral home. She, her mother Jacqueline Nichols, and her boyfriend Justin Jones were on their way home just after midnight Friday, traveling along 42nd Street Northwest when they were struck head on by 24 year old Robert Harrison of Bartow. Investigators say Harrison was drunk behind the wheel of his truck driving north here on 42nd Street when he swerved into the path of an oncoming van. Investigators say Harrison's blood alcohol level was about one and a half times the legal limit. We will do everything we can to do to send him to prison for a very, very long time because of his stupidness of drinking and driving, then this baby's life's been snuffed out and that's totally unacceptable. Nichols and Jones were taken to the hospital where they're still recovering from serious injuries, including head trauma. She enjoyed life. She we enjoyed doing sandcastles on the lake where I live. Nichols says his granddaughter loved playing outside, diving into the water any chance she got, and eating her favorite, ice cream. They shared a bond he will never allow to be broken. I have pictures on my walls where she painted stuff. Those are staying on the walls forever. She, she will be remembered. She will be rem remembered by all. In Auburndale, Carla Byron, Fox 13 News. Madden leaves behind two older siblings, a brother and sister. Harrison is charged with DUI manslaughter and driving under the influence. He's being held without bond and is due back in court again next month.